But this is a fun project to do with air dry clay inspired by the artist Yoe Kasuma. Uh, she loved polka dots um, and made these infinity runes. Uh, if you look at her artwork, you'll see lots of this style going on. So first of all, use your air dry clay and make different pieces of fruit. Um, you can do different objects, but she liked to use pumpkins uh, for her artwork. But as you can see, we've made some different pieces of fruit. Um, you can make the same. Once you have made the different pieces of fruit, uh, you just need to leave them overnight just so they dry nice and hard. Then what you need to do is get the template off the Tez store, uh, draw around it onto a piece of thick card and then just cut that out. After you've done that, you can then paint your piece of fruit and the card that you've cut out all in one colour. Again, leave these to dry uh, for a few hours. So we made uh, three different ones, so again we painted them all different colours. Once you've done that, you'll need to get either a paintbrush or Posca pens work really well to do polka dots on the fruit and on the card. Once these are all done and dry, you can then fold the card to make an open box and place your piece of fruit inside to make your infinity room. You can play around with different colors and different objects inside of these. Um, just have fun with it and if you like this please follow my YouTube channel for more art ideas and my test store.